First at 6 o'clock, the big turnpike expansion project called Access Oklahoma is now starting after years of delays and legal challenges. Thanks for joining us at 6. I'm Lori Fulbright. And I'm Craig Day. The first phase is a widening project on the Turner Turnpike, and some lanes are already closed tonight. News on 6's Emery Bryan is live in Bristow, where the work is getting started. Emery? Well, the Turnpike Authority says widening this stretch of the Turnpike will certainly improve safety and it will also improve the flow of traffic all the way from Tulsa out here. They also plan to increase the speed limit on this stretch. The groundbreaking marks the start of a 15-year construction plan for the Turnpike Authority. The first project on the list is widening this section of the Turner from four to six lanes. It'll be lit, six lanes, wide shoulders, wide center, uh, inside shoulder, uh, highway lighting at night, major safety improvement for this area. The wider section will look like this stretch just to the east of the upcoming project with lights on the medium barrier and much wider shoulders. It will end at the Route 66 junction at Bristow where eventually the OTA plans to rebuild the interchange. Tim Gatz, who until yesterday ran both ODOT and the OTA, said this is why there's overlap between turnpikes and taxpayer funded road work. 16, 48, 66, all that comes together and then has an interchange with I-44. No choice but to work together. The construction plan has worked moving from east to west, starting near Hayburn, which will gain access to the turnpike for the first time. Governor Stitt, who made sure he broke the most ground at the groundbreaking, said this project is important, even as he said turnpikes should be limited. The turnpikes, as long as we're, we have the turnpikes already, I'm not a big fan of building new turnpikes, uh, but uh, this turnpike here, widen it, I think is the right thing to do to alleviate the, uh, the traffic between Oklahoma City and Tulsa. The inside lanes of this stretch will close overnight for the delivery of thousands of orange barrels that will be out here for two years. This is a $98 million project, a significant construction that will affect the flow of traffic. With some block lanes will begin on March 11th. Reporting live in Bristow, Emory Bryan, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6.